welcome back to the the important question paper discussion for the subject sensors and transducers in this video i am going to discuss important questions from module 5 so please pay the attention this will be really helpful for cracking your university examination uh, the i have seen the question paper uh, from in btu june july 2018 and i have noticed some important questions and i want to discuss with you so question number for like uh, 2008, June, July 2018, the first question is, what is temperature? Definition of temperature. What are the temperature measuring instruments? Okay, classification of temperature measurement instruments. For example, thermometer, thermocouple, etc. You need to explain briefly. Seven marks. Okay, uh, three plus four marks. Uh, give comparison between thermistor and the metal resistor. You have to explain with the help of characteristics. Then, uh, briefly explain the working of radiation pyrometer. So, we carries 5 marks, 2 marks for your diagram, 3 marks for your explanation. Explain the neat sketch and explain the working of uh, then electromagnetic flow meter. How does it work? How to measure the velocity, acceleration, etc. with the help of flow meters. You need to explain with the help of schematic diagram. Describe the following with the neat diagram. Photoelectric tachometer, DC tachometer. How do you measure the speed? Then explain the liquid level measurement by using lenser, laser, laser. Okay, you have to explain with what is laser, how you are going to explain uh, the like uh, liquid level by using this technique. So, uh, try to add uh, some schematic diagram along with your explanation that carries more weightage so that you can convince the examiner in a better manner. June, July 2023, I have seen some important uh, questions with the help of need diagram. Uh, inductive proximity detector and ultrasonic proximity detector. Proximity sensors are mainly identifies uh, the presence of an object. Explain the various methods for flow monitoring liquid level flow sensors. Both the questions carry 10 marks. Write a short note on the method to measure moisture and humidity. You can go ahead with any type of methods. Explain the neat diagram and explain the smoke and the fire detectors. This is also important. Right. All carries 10 marks. 5 marks for your schematic diagram, uh, graphical representation, waveforms, etc. And the rest of the 5 marks is for your better explanation. Try to highlight your important points for the university examination. Describe the measurement of shaft power using eddy current dynamometer with neat diagram. Explain the operation of electromagnetic flow meters with a suitable diagram. Each carries 8 and 8, 16 marks. Uh, with the neat diagram, explain the measurement of small displacement by using linear variable differential transducers, which we have already discussed in the module 2. Explain the theory of operation of uh, laser and uh, like uh, explanation. What is light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation? You have to explain the different stages. Okay, right. So, in the year of 2019, uh, you can see some questions like uh, what is Seebeck effect. Whenever you are studying about thermocouple, you will be familiar in one of the phenomena called the Seebeck effect. In that, you have to explain about hot metal, like a cold metal, like metal junction. Okay. Then, how you are going to convert the difference in temperature in terms of voltage. So, try to write some mathematical expression. Explain the neat diagram of construction and working of thermoelectric pyrometer. What is uh, like a rotometer and the elbow meter? Similarly, explain briefly about DC taco generator and AC taco generator. Each carries four marks. Explain piezoelectric accelerometer and the ultrasonic liquid level gauge. Okay, these are the important questions you can expect in the forthcoming examination also uh, in the another manner. Apart from that, I have listed out some important questions which you can expect in the upcoming examination. Classification of temperature machine instruments. Uh, then uh, operation of resistance temperature detector that is RTD. What is thermocoupled? Explain the working of thermo thermoelectric pyrometer. Derived expressions of flow of venturi meter that mathematical expression. Explain the working of electromagnetic flow meter and uh, obtain the expressions for straight flow. Then ultrasonic flow meter. Operation of thermal flow meter. Working of anemometer. Uh, anemometer. Uh, then advantages and disadvantages of anemometer. Explain the method of measurement of displacement. Any method can be suggested. Then go ahead with the uh, angular velocity measurement, seismic accelerometer, measurement of torque. Go ahead with uh, any other method. You can go ahead with the measurement of torque. Then uh, measurement of viscosity. Explain the electrical uh, level gauge of measurement of liquid level. So we can anticipate these questions also in the upcoming examination. Prepare well. Try to highlight your 
concept by uh, by representing diagrams graph equations uh, then along with that try to highlight your answers thank you so much for watching this video happy learning have a great day if you really uh, useful for this particular channel i request you to subscribe our channel thank you